Hey there, everyone. Welcome back. So breaking news from around the world. So today, within 24 hours, there was 3,200 people that ended up passing away. And the death toll is now over 2,700 total and people infected, over 500,000 infected. So the United States is the worst place so far hit in the world. It says 18,691 new cases and 400 new deaths in the United States. Apex of hospital could be in 21 days from now in New York. All hospitals need to increase capacity by 50 to 100 percent. Wow. Some are needing 140,000 hospital beds, need a total of 40,000 ICU. Currently only have 3,000 and 30,000 ventilators and need an additional 37,000 ICU beds. And they said over 138,000 people have been tested. And this is not going to be a short deployment. This is going to be weeks and weeks and weeks to actually deal with this. And the death total and the total infected in the United States now is 1,700 deaths and over 100,000 cases of infected people. Then here in Canada, it says there's 714 new cases and 16 new deaths. So there's one new death in Russia, three new deaths and 302 new cases in Ireland, 16 new cases and one new death in Cameroon, 23 new cases and two deaths in Lebanon, 30 new cases and two deaths in Tunisia, 40 new cases and one death in Algeria, 59 cases and one new death in Lithuania, 71 new cases and one death in Serbia, 74 new cases and one death in Greece, 112 new cases and five new deaths in Panama, 113 new cases and one new death in Venezuela, 169 new cases and 11 new deaths in Denmark, 172 new cases and two new deaths in Pakistan, 229 new cases and 28 new deaths in Sweden, 399 new cases and five new deaths in Norway, 724 new cases and 16 new deaths in Portugal, 1,400 new cases and 69 new deaths in Belgium, 1,117 new cases and 39 new deaths in Switzerland, 1,172 new cases and 112 new deaths in Netherlands, 1,627 infected and 41 new dead in Ecuador, 2,069 new cases and 17 new deaths in Turkey, 5,909 new cases and 919 new deaths deaths in Italy, 6,933 new cases and 84 new deaths in Germany, Austria 788 new cases and 9 new deaths, Brazil reports 432 new cases and 15 new deaths. France has a total of 3,809 new cases and 299 new deaths. 153 new cases and 9 new deaths in Indonesia. 144 new deaths and 2,962 new cases in Iran. Japan reports 2 new deaths and 112 new cases. Morocco reports 70 new cases and 12 new deaths. Peru has 55 new infected and 2 new deaths. Romania, 263 new cases and 3 new deaths. 2 new deaths and 242 infected cases in South Africa. 7,933 cases and 773 deaths in Spain. 25 new cases and 1 new death in Togo. And then other places around the world, it states that there's 152 new cases and 6 new deaths in Luxembourg. 22 new cases and 1 new death in Moldova. 13 new cases and 1 new death in... Is Bakistan, 28 new cases and two new deaths in Bokin Faso, 304 new cases and one new death in Chile, one new case and one new death in Trinidad Tobago, uh, 2,885 new cases and 181 new deaths in the United Kingdom, one new death in Argentina, 76 new cases and four new deaths in Iraq, 70 new cases and three new deaths in Slovenia, as well as 96 new cases and nine new deaths in the Philippines, 91 new cases and one new death death in Thailand, 110 new cases and two new deaths in Mexico, and one new death in Nicaragua. So I just want to say my heart, my prayers, and everything just it goes out to all the people that are being impacted and affected by this. This is just tragic, and I just wish this would have never happened. Yeah, I'll keep trying to keep you updated as much as I can. It's just some of these updates are just way too crazy. Like every day, like it used to be like over a thousand people. Then it started to get a couple of days ago, 2000 within 24 hours. And now, uh, now it's like over 3000 people a day within 24 hours. And I give it a couple more days. It's going to be four or 5,000. And then I give it another week. It's going to be in the tens of thousands. And it's just going to go up to eventually hundreds of thousands. But yeah, I'll keep educating and updating you as much as I can. I really, truly do appreciate all the love and support. It really means a lot to me. So yeah, if you could just do me a huge favor and just share my videos because it seems like on YouTube and like other places when you type in uh, any of these titles, it doesn't pop up. It's like they're like blocking them.
So if you could just do me a favor, share these videos, like this video, comment down below with your opinion and thoughts, and click that subscribe button. So thanks for watching, everyone. I really appreciate it. Stay safe. God bless. Peace out.